I am challenging our students to seek for excellence by choosing a goal in the three areas of our mission, educating the mind, nurturing the spirit, and strengthening the body. Because I don't want to ask students to do anything that I would not be willing to do myself, I'm setting my own personal goals in these areas and will be reporting my results to them. Hello students, as you can see I'm up here at the high school gym and I'm going to give you an assessment of how I'm doing on my physical goal. But before that I do that, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about why I have that goal and why you should have that goal. When we're working on this physical goal, you have to keep in mind that everything that we do in our life depends on our physical well-being. So our emotional, our social, our intellectual, all needs to have that physical basis for us to be successful. You'll have a long life ahead of you and with many activities and if you want to have the energy to be able to do the things that you'll need to do in your life to be a parent and to take care of your family and to have a job and a career, you're building right now that physical structure. All through our lives we have to remain physically active but especially right now is a time when you're creating the physical body that's going to take you through your whole life. Let me just give you one example. As we age, our bones tend to lose their density. So older people, women and men, have an issue about losing the structure of their bodies and their bones. It's in our youth, the time that you have right now, that we build that bone density. And that's what carries us through life. Part of my goal right now, I'm lifting weights, and that's to conserve the bone density I have, but if I hadn't built it when I was young, I wouldn't have it to conserve. So that's just one area. The habits that we have also affect us throughout our whole lives. So the habits that you're creating right now, uh, smoking, using alcohol, or other drugs are going to affect your health and your ability to have a quality of life and do all the things that you want to do in your life. All of you in your B classes get a fitness gram, and that'll show you kind of where you're at. And you have your teachers now, and your parents will help you set goals for that physical part of your mission as a student. Um, it's helpful to have somebody talk to you with, about your goals and what's reasonable and what you should be able to expect to perform. I do that with my goals. I have here. Bobby or 90s. Bobby knows a lot about weightlifting and I'm doing weightlifting to conserve my bones and also to help me with my 
uh, weight goals because for me it's hard to keep my weight down. So Bobby, I wanted to ask you how have I been doing in terms of following through with coming and, and exercise in the morning? It's been really, really good. You've been here consistently. You've been on time. We've had made great progress in, in your weightlifting capabilities. We've gone pretty much every single exercise has increased from 15 to 20 pounds in each individual um, working exercise. So we started off maybe with, let's say, for example, 45 pounds on the shoulder press, and we've increased to 65 pound reps. So that means that you've done sets of 10, 10 to 12 reps per exercise. Now I notice on the wall it says here something about effort. How has my effort been? Your effort been, has been outstanding. You've tried every single exercise to its max, even when it's felt like, okay, I'm really tired, you still have gone, gone your extra effort and completed your exercises. Now, my goal is just my goal. I don't have to compete with anybody else. And it's the same with you. I may never be able to lift as much as Bobby lifts, but I can get better at where I'm at. I'm older than a lot of you, so I don't have the same capability of growth, but I do have the ability to grow and improve from where I'm at. So each of our goals should be looking at how do we compete with ourselves. What I'm doing today is an assessment, checking what my maximum weight is and how much I've progressed since I started. I've been working on learning to play the piano and I'm going to attempt to play a piece called Claire de Lune. <laughs> 